Good morning everybody, welcome to my creative time with Emma and also welcome to another Manly Monday. First of all, I hope everybody had a fabulous, fabulous Easter weekend. Um, we had an amazing weekend of course, um, you know just being with family is always the best so we had a great time over the weekend and we got to celebrate it Saturday with like my parents and my sisters, my nieces and nephew. We always celebrate like, you know, the Saturday before the holiday and then on Sunday we all celebrate it with our own families at home. So it's nice. Um, so anyways, another one more thing I wanted to kind of touch on as well for our Flash Friday um, sale. Since it was a busy weekend, I just wanted to let you know that all of those orders are going out today, between today and tomorrow. So I just wanted to let you know, I forgot to tell you on Friday that all of the orders were going to be going out on Monday, okay, which is today. So a lot of orders, most likely they're all going to go out today, but just in case, um, they'll be going out between today and tomorrow. Okay, everyone? Okay, so for my card today, I am going to show you what I'm going to be using. I am going to be using this awesome brand new Hello die, and this is the one that we featured on our Friday. Um, we had a blog hop using this die on Friday last week. And then I'm using my little mustache dies. This is from my set, an older set called What's Growing On. Um, and then I'm using my Oh Dear Revise, and I'm using the Dear stamp, right? The one that's spelled D-E-A-R. Um, that's what I'm using. Oh, and I'm also using my More Stitched Edges die, okay? So, well, let me grab everything here. I had this, like, piece of cardstock that, that was just kind of left over in my stash. So I just went ahead and I scored it, and it landed up being, let's see, it's like three and a quarter, it's like three and a quarter by five and a quarter. So I figured we could use this as a card base. I don't want, I didn't want to waste this paper. Um, because this is my favorite paper tray ink. I, I do not like wasting theirs, um, their cardstock. So, I figured let's do this. And then I also had like a little stash of a little, um, pattern paper that I had left as well. So this is going to go probably like so. And I, this is what I use my little more stitched edge dies. I use the little torn edge die that comes in that set, which I love. Now I what you know what actually I was going to um, let me find some adhesive. You know what? Let's see. Let's just use this. I was going to do um, pop this up, but then actually I decided not to. So let me just go ahead. I need a little tape runner. <laughs> you know those little tape runners. Um, but for now, I'm just going to use this right here. Like so. Okay. I, it seems like I just go through those tape runners so quick. Okay, so let's see. So this I'm going to go ahead and just put in the center of my card. Like so. Hopefully that's in the center enough. Okay. And then what we're going to do is I cut out one of the little mustache dies in some white foam. I was thinking about putting a color on there, then I decided not to. Um, then I have the hello right here. I also cut that out in foam. Um, and then I cut out this, I wish I actually had this cut out already in red. Um, that's going to go like so. And then I have this black piece of, um, just a little black piece of cardstock, which is going to go right here. And I'm just going to heat emboss this. I wonder if I should just do it. You know, I'm not going to put it down just yet. I figured just in case I mess up, because if I mess up, all I have to do is just turn it around and redo it on the back. So let me go ahead and just grab my little powder tool here. I'm just going to go ahead and just put some little embossing powder on there. Let me figure out where I want this. So I'm going to put it right there. So let me grab my Versamark ink. And we're going to go ahead and just stamp deer on there. Okay, so 
I need my re-inker for this. All right, so let me scooch that on up. Okay, that looks good. And let me grab some white embossing powder. Let me see. Yeah, that's white right there. And we're just going to quickly emboss this. So hopefully this is going to come out the way I envisioned it. Sometimes not all. Of course I stamped it on here a little cricket, but... It's all right. It's not the end of the world. So I'm just going to take off this extra powder that does not need to be on here with using a little paintbrush. Okay, let me go ahead. I'm just going to go ahead and heat, use my heat tool, tool to heat this up really quick. Okay, so here it goes like so. So this is just going to, let's see, maybe that's too high. There we go. All right, so let me put this little embossing powder back really quick. So for this, let me use, let's see. I'm gonna use this here. This tape, so I could pop this up. Okay, let me make sure this is not thicker <laughs> than the tape. Okay, I think we should be good. We should be safe with this. And it's a little bit longer than here. Let me just trim. Give that a little trimmy trim. Okie dokie. I went ahead and I just put that little strip there and then what I'm going to do is I am, let me find my little adhesive, I'm just going to use my little multi-medium mat. Um, let me move this out of the way. I'm just going to put some adhesive right on to this, to the foam piece of this die, of the die cut I should say. And I think when I put it on I want it to have like a little, well, I'm going to try at least. <laughs> I want it to have a little white shadow. Um, so I'm not going to line it up like perfectly like I would in any other situation. Okay. All right, wish me luck. <laughs> Let's see, where's my, I need some tweezers. Let's go ahead and get this on here. Actually, why am I doing it on here? Let me move this, put it on here better. Oopsie, it's probably too far up for you, huh? Let me scooch that down. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go ahead. Like I said, I'm gonna attempt, oopsie, to do a little shadow of this, which actually, there we go, it's not too bad. Not too bad for my first try. Let me grab something to put on top of there to kind of hold it down a tad. Yeah, I wanted to give a little shadow effect. You see how you can see it through the block where you can see the white shadow behind there. Um, I'm gonna try and measure this so I could get this on while that's drying. Let me put this down here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and just place this on here. I think, where's my die at? Actually, let me use the die instead. Oh, you know what? Actually, no, I have a backup here. So let's just use this as my guide where I'm going to put this because I also want to put my little mustache right there as well. Okay, let's put it right here. Okay, perfecto. And then this is gonna go like so. I wasn't gonna put it on, but you know what? I think I am. 
I think this looks cute. I haven't used this little mustache in a really long time. It's perfect for today's theme. Okay, let me just... Now, if this was not a manly card, I totally glittered this mustache up, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it alone, and this should be dry, I think. Okay. Let me find the cover to this. Here we go. Okie dokie. So, put this aside, and then we'll go ahead and just add our... I'm going to add this right here. Actually, there. I think this didn't dry completely yet because I've scooched that up a bit. There we go. Actually, it actually came out really cute without even me putting anything down yet. So let me go ahead and flip this around. And I'm going to go ahead and just put some more adhesive behind this. Okie dokie, we got all the adhesive on there. Let's go ahead and flip this around. There we go. A super simple card, and I love this big hello die because it's like a big focal point. Now, like again, I would love to add some Wink of Stella to the actual hello um, <laughs> and the red part of the hello, but you know what? I'm just going to... Gosh, I feel like I need something. I just don't know what. Um, I may just leave it alone. But anyways, I'm just going to leave it alone for right now. If I add anything, you'll see, it, um, <laughs> you'll see it in the picture at the end of the video. So that is it, everyone. Thank you so, so much for tuning in. Um, don't forget to visit my blog at www.creativetimeforme.com to see what the rest of my awesome design team has made for you for this Manly Monday. Okay, everyone? So have a fabulous day, and I will see you all back here tomorrow. Bye-bye.